knocked out by the play zone. And you can already see teams are struggling to get by. But Burrow now Ooh. finds it down as well. This does not look great for Evo's VIP. Nate after Nate. Small boy hoping to catch him all off. And maybe with a stroke of luck, they may be able to find something. Well, that the debut season for the Wonder Kid is looking pretty good. And Bravo drives on top of Doxy. And that's going to be the first road kill that you are seeing for the season. Small boy, just keep keeping all of them. But Evo's VIP, what is their next move? I don't think much of an option is available for them. They have to go in for the Hail Mary of anything. Or I hope for the... Uh, the Formerly the four rivals to actually contest it against RSG. Meanwhile, Wales already meeting against Yudu Alliance here. Dinks getting shot down. Kim actually just waiting his position here, snaking along. Wales looking to push, oh. but they will ultimately go down to the blue zone. And Wales just look to clean up. It just seems like a end-all be-all for them with all most the majority of their members already in the blue zone. They will be eliminated at 16th place. Simbi may not be able to make it out of the blue zone, though. He's already getting his health chipped off. So the rest of Wills, they've been leaving Snappy behind, per thing. But here comes April coming in with a backstab as well. This may not look all too great, but Evil Snappy, they have to take one fight at a time. So now with push, they find April. He gets knocked down. But the rest of RSG, are they going to be moving alongside as well? Insomnus will be able to actually chip some damage. Wow, Razor secures the kill. That's a point going in for the side of Evo's VIP. They've already lost their team captain, Luxy. Meanwhile, Kim right under the bridge. And Appy is going to do exactly the same to keep the Tigers off of the bridge. Oh, the dynamics have changed. Four rivals playing it very smart here with the, the diversion play. Actually makes way for his friends to drive on by. Sure, you lose one, but you didn't lose everyone. And you're still very well in the game. And now you're the ones gatekeeping Evos uh, from actually making an entrance. But Sam Z, he's there. They know he actually missed the shot. So oh, they oh. might got to capitalize on that. They will take Appy down. So four rivals loses two. They make it through, but Evos now has another, uh, another problem to solve here because they still cannot cross the bridge. A couple of smoke trails have already been set up. At least Sam Z has been able to recuperate, but right in front of them is going to be four rivals, and that's where Rex! My word! Zix is going to be pulling all those shots from afar with that DP spray down. Right down below, Kim is just keeping himself alive, and that is... Kim being so far away from the rest of RSG, but now they just have to book it and wing it with all the vision being all negated. Razor goes right down below, but he drives to the other den as well with Batman waiting right down below. That's a free pickup while Insomnus is already down. Sam Z swims alongside Kim. Evos just getting shredded. Just they tried to push in through, but unfortunately the all Hail Mary play did not work out with Batman just gatekeeping here. Uh Kim is swimming in the waters together with Sam Z. So they, they keep, do they see each other? Do you think Kim would Most message likely. Batman like, hey, someone's on my back, someone's on my tail here. Make sure to take him out. Because he's he's trying to come into shore. And RSG, the whole squad's just waiting here with the red car. But RSG now trying to make the way forward. It has the vehicle. We'll be driving forth. And VXM. Yeah, I guess we'll take a look at them as they try to, you know, engage onto another team. Just across the opposite side. Homeboys as well. Holding it there. Oh, the grenade. It cooked. It hit. VXM pushing in with the, with the vehicle. Oh boy, and now moving alongside as well, they just have to uh, get by because the rest of SMG, they're already in the middle of the circle. That's going to be a pink. Oh my word, John. With pretty much short scopes, he's been able to knock him down off of that roof. Now that's going to be a little bit of trouble for the side of Wills as well, where we have Stewart hiding inside of the hut. Mickey's going to be doing exactly the same for the side of Fangs, but he's going to outnumber the likes of Team Wills. Now, Stewart, he's got nowhere to run, but the rest of the members of Fangs, they really don't really have options here, but that grenade is oh. just about enough to actually knock them all down. Now we're only down to six teams. Home boys with Naoki picking another point right through at Axis Esports. They're just trying to hold in towards this solid compound, but eventually they might need to give way to the hands of Team Bosker as well as Fangs. 
Axis had it the most comfortable for this game one on Aaron Girl actually choosing to drop onto the military brace but Boss Guru actually going head to head against R2K here as he takes down one, one more left in the bag and they'll be firing, switching firing power at each other. R2K, he is up against the entire squad or three members of Boss Guru will lose the trade out. Uh, no surprise there but he stood valiant and well... A plus for efforts, I'd say. Axis, though, being very passive. Do people even know they're in this compound? They haven't even shot a single. They do now against BXM and takes them out. Wait a minute. Did Mika just, just wiped out the entirety of the team? I'm fumbling because I was just looking at the kill feed and it was all Mika by himself take out the entirety of Thanks. Now, Grenade Galore over on the side of Bosker as well as Homeboys where these exchanges are actually going nowhere. But Bosker, they have to force their way in. And the rest of Axis, they're just waiting alongside uh, SMG to see who's going to be able to break out of all these Mexican standoff. But Voki, Mika, all of them having full, full squads advantage against Homeboys as well as Bosker. Even if they were to go in for a certain invade, it's going to be pretty tough. But the grenades, they're dropping really closely through the side of Naoki. They're just proning on the ground, needing to keep themselves silently still or else Axis may just be able to chip right in and look at team smg they've got some great vantage point across those opposite side of nova yeah it seems like the final could already be predicted between these two uh to stand off here because they don't they literally don't have to do anything play patient eventually it's already the seventh circle it's gonna come in it's gonna wipe either boss crew or hbl homeboys which eventually is gonna be uh homeboys first because they didn't have the number advantage unless naoki can pull sort of clutch no gets shot down by the grass side boss crew secured numerous points for their end and now we'll finally have to push downwards but smg has eyes on them on the high ground will tap fire axis now knows that on the opposing side on the opposite side of their compound he sees what wow. takes down as far z will knock him off confirms the kill as well tricks nitty now five kills under the side of smg they are on fire right now and that's a clinical finish as well just looking at them going for that massive threat of a damage and there was nowhere that Asfar could have run as far as he can. Well, definitely intended uh, for sure. <laughs> so back towards these two st teams that are standing off, and all one of them will walk away with the very first chicken dinner of the regular season. So SMG, they're the ones who need to find a little bit more of that opening, but everyone's currently hugging by the corners of the walls. Now, on that open garage, Bart may not be in the best position possible, but just look at the rest of Axis. They have a wider spread with that 2-2 split, which they could just focus fire on either side. And that's speaking of which, Foki opens up and finds the head of Bart at Team SMG. They're having one member down. They need to quickly go in for the revive. And those grenade galore is going to be coming right in as well. Snitty going in, down proning. And he's just going to be looking by the garage. He finds Hey Noob. Hey Noob's going to go down to the hands oh. of Jenny from the top side of the balcony. And now Voki's on the push. Voki's on the rush. He's going to be able to get one. He breaks the vehicle. He's looking for six. But as he pushes right in, there's still... Tricks Nitty, and he might just hear the prone coming out of six. Or oh, the trading bodies one on one here, but Axis seems to be coming to one on top, except SMG. Now, one they're, they're just trading bodies at this point, but Axis that now he has to find jenny jenny has the high ground he could oversee the entire squadron he does see him Voki with the nades does connect he will now have one third of his hp but has to heal up here can he create a hell mary jenny is the last one standing from smg noticing that all the other members from axis are still alive and they throw the nade to finish it off it cooks and then it blows up and the first winner winner chicken dinner goes the side of axis esports Axis rate one with Foki leading the pack has finally found their way with, with, with a brand new team. He has that aura of a champion to bring along with him. And that's your first game being concluded. Congratulations, Axis Esports. Now, as we look down the list as well, Team SMG, they were pretty much stuck over the corner of the play zone already. And Denny, 
he didn't really have all too much that he could possibly do unless if he hops downwards to challenge Voki. But Voki is seems it, it just seems like he's unstoppable. You know, like I I've been trying to find those words out there to conclude that massive play that they just did. Not many of these teams have that confidence in that final run in phase eight as well as phase nine to just rush in for those final few moments. But Axis, right one, they look to be on fire. Yeah, Axis definitely goes the way of Axis here. Um, well, all credit is where credit is due, but they also, there's not, we don't, we, we're not gonna dis uh, discredit the fact that they, although they got the best drop spot for this circle in this map at this current point in time, doesn't mean they didn't play it all too smart, well, and well, very methodical. So uh, we've got a highlight all queued up whenever you're ready. Let's switch it on to it. 